We're continuing on with our quilt blocks on the baby quilt. Again, we're going to continue using like the picture frame going around the block. I've gone ahead and stitched the diagonal so it looks like we have four quadrants here. And now I'm going to show you how to stitch a pinwheel in these areas. Backtrack along this one line here. Now when I was setting this up, I did um, mark with a very fine line, air erasable marker of the diagonals as well as a horizontal and vertical line going through the square. So now we've subdivided that out. And this is kind of a tricky part because if I don't mark these, I'm afraid that I will stitch in them. So we're going to have this as a stitch, no stitch, stitch, no stitch, stitch, no stitch, stitch. And I think what I'm going to do is just uh, fill this up with right, bubbles. pathway will be best if we end in the center. So here we are right here and I'm going to make this line and I marked stitch, no stitch, so stitch. This line has already been stitched, so we'll go stitch, no stitch, stitch, no stitch, stitch. center and we will stitch our line here so we have a stitch no stitch so stitch here and this will be our last one Take a look at our finished block. So you have a pinwheel. If I can get a little bit better lighting. Maybe this way, huh? So you can see the pinwheel. And there, of course, is our little elephant block. Okay, great. Join me again. Remember to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks.